Welcome back to Perk Chops. This is the second module in the How to Play Drums from Scratch series. Today we'll be discussing foot pedal control and techniques. Pedal techniques can be broken up into two categories. That's heel up and heel down. I recommend practicing or trying to develop both because you never know which one you may need. Let's look at what each has to offer. It's important to understand the power chain and whichever technique that you're using. The power chain in the heels up technique starts at the hip flexors, goes down the leg to the knee, down the leg through the ankle, and ends at the ball of the foot. This is why you can use your entire leg for more power. The same goes for the hi-hat pedal. For a more powerful sound, use the weight of your leg. Now the heel down power chain is generated from the muscle on the front of the leg known as the tibialis anterior, which allows the foot to move up and down using the heel as a pivot point. This means the heel down technique, your power is based on the strength of that muscle. And again, I suggest developing both techniques, but to start out, choose one that feels the most comfortable and the most natural. Now let's cover a couple of exercises to practice with the pedals. These examples will be played at 60 BPM and 4 for a time. This exercise emphasizes on keeping the time with the hi-hat while playing kick beats on beats 1 and 3. This exercise emphasizes on playing straight quarter notes on the kick and back beats on two and four with the hi-hat. This exercise, as well as the previous one, can be practiced heel up or heel down, or both. In this lesson, we covered the power chain with the heel up and the heel down technique, and also two exercises that will help you build stamina and control in both feet. Keep practicing, and remember, play drums. 